what are the myths of leadership that drive you nuts? You know, what are the what are you what are you trying to disprove in the way that you think about leadership? You know, some people think um, leadership is for people. It's just for some people. Mm. Like that person's a leader. I'm not a leader. I'm a doer. And yeah. I think everyone has to lead themselves. So I think leadership right. is for everyone. Now, that doesn't mean some people don't lead teams and some people don't lead organizations. There are deeper right. levels of it. But self-leadership is the most important thing because if you can't lead yourself, you, right. you have yeah. a lot of homework to do. I mean, you have a lot of stuff to work on. What do, you, what do you mean by self-leadership? Because it's one of those things that I intuitively nod my head to. And then I'm like, but wait a sec. If I'm leading a team, I've got followers. And, you know, there's that great thing, which is like, you're not a leader unless you have some people who are following you. Um, but when you're a self-leadership, who's following what? You're following a vision that you desire for your life. So okay, that's nice. you create a vision in your head of what you want yeah. to do or where you want to go. And then you hold yourself accountable to that vision. That is self-leadership. Just having the vision and not going there is not leadership. That's just being a visionary. And so that's how I would describe it um, in a nutshell. And, you know, what we teach, by the way, just so you have context, is like, do you guys have uh, like Lowe's home improvement stores in Canada? Well, I think so. And we certainly have the equivalent um, of that. So, yeah. Just think of this Basically, massive. big box store, lots yeah. of wood, lots of tools, lots of right. furniture, pat- patio furniture. So, so you got you you got it. So, you, if Lowe's was a leadership development store, or your home improvement was a leadership development store, there's thousands of tools for leaders. Mm, what we exactly. teach exploratory leadership is one end cap in that massive yeah. store. Now, it's a linchpin. Uh, skill because it, you know it would be akin to not having a hammer in your toolbox because right. everyone needs to, to know how to navigate change and create possibility yeah. but it's very small so our universe is small but how, how we do teach it is under that premise that you actually need to be able to lead yourself first and right. another myth of leadership that is 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 that there's a way <laughs> like there's one way. And I have been in peer to group, peer to peer groups since 1989, very long time. Yeah. And people are remarkably different. They're like kids. Everyone is different with their style. Right. And there is no one way. We'd love to have you as a subscriber. Just hit that subscribe button.